What's up guys, today I want to show you little tips and tricks when using the cut tool. Before we begin, I just want to say that we are all blessed if you're listening to be here in 2019. I have a lot of big plans for the channel this year and I hope you guys stick around for it. If you're new, I hope you consider subscribing and let's all grow and learn together. Alright, so let's begin it. So today's tutorial is going to be about the cut tool and I have here a music video that I was currently working on. A, it should be out by now, it's the Joker Poem One of a Kind video. And yeah, so let's get to the cut tool. The cut tool is the tool that you're going to be using when it comes to slicing and creating those little flash effects. I'll show you. For the shortcut for the cut tool, you can press C or you could just go down to the little razor tool. Uh, but C is the shortcut, I suggest you learn it so it just becomes natural when you want to use it. It's a simple tool but effective because you can do a lot with it. This is the tool that you create slices like if you're cutting to a beat and one simple tip that I want to give you when using the cut tool is I think a lot of people don't notice but when you're cutting let's say you have a music video that you're editing and you want to add it to the beat what you can do with the cut tool is wherever you want to slice let's say you have your project set up and you have them stacked similar where you have different angles or different shots what you could do is stack them like this and wherever you want to cut, for example, let's say on this, let's say on this clap right here, what you could do, just basically click it right there and like create a cut or if you have them stacked and you want everything to be cut, just simply hold shift and then cut and simple as that you've cut everything everything below that stack is going to be cut if you don't want a certain clip to be cut what you could do is lock whatever clip that you don't want to be cut and then you can just cut again yeah like i said it's a simple but effective tool if you wanted that flash effect where you want multiple clips cut you can simply hold shift make your cut on the clap hit the back arrow make a cut again back arrow cut again back arrow cut again and simply just choose in and out which clips that you want to show below and that way you'll have like a little a little uh, a little flash effect uh, just make sure the bottom clips are on and simple as that you've created a a flash effect by using the cut tool okay let me render that right so bear in mind too that the clips that you don't want to be cut below the stack just make sure you hit the lock like your audio you want to lock that so it doesn't cut and yeah that's basically it so if this video was helpful be sure to hit that subscribe button in the future i'm going to be doing a music video breakdown where i break down maybe some of the videos i've already shot maybe go in depth a little more i'll show you how i put them together uh, just comment the names below i guess and i'll be doing that video real soon thanks